Hello my Alets and welcome back to another video. I'm so glad you guys are here and I am so excited to start this project. So uh, let's jump in. So, so during November last year I started this junk ring and I say I started because I didn't get through the whole month and I was actually doing um, finding joy in the everyday with gratitude and I was going to do gratitude every day and not that I don't have gratitude every day but I just did not document it but I feel like I love this tag. I have it hanging in my studio um, in this one that I'm in right now. Um, and I don't know. I think I may um, continue. Like maybe if I do 2023 and then I and then maybe do another tag of like 2024 and just kind of like keep adding. Um, to the tag because that's kind of like what I have in mind for this again sometimes you start a project and you don't know how it's going to end that's that's a lot with me because I could you know it, I could start it and then kind of like I did with this one got busy ran out of time but I still want to fill this up with all the things that I love about fall and showing gratitude and I love the month of November because it's kind of that in between um, slow down phase almost kind of kind of sort of but before the holiday season begins and it's just well it is a holiday season but the Christmas month when everything seems to be happening <laughs> so so what I had thought about doing on this particular project this was a kit that we had come out um, not this last no yeah this last month so it was called best summer let me get the stickers out for you best summer life and I'll tell you exactly kind of what I'm thinking um, the idea behind it so with this um, I want to do like I have this really cute cloud um, and I used to hang my washi on it um, but I'm thinking that this would be really cute to hang like the different seasons so things that I love about fall things that I love about winter summer spring and um, I know I mentioned it many many times on this channel before that I'm not a summer person I am a summer baby don't get you know we it, it, it's strange because once June's done I'm done with summer like a hundred percent um yeah I know it's because it's so hot here I think if I was somewhere else I can't say that I don't like summer altogether but anyway that's kind of where I'm at because it's so hot here um where we're at and so okay so enough about the weather seems like I always get on that subject <laughs> but let's um let's jump into it so i also have this i have been wanting to include this in one of my kits i actually handed it out at a um memory keeping event i did and this is actually by echo park um, it's actually cartabella paper so it's that really nice thick um textured paper but look how fun and i did this one with a vicky booten um several years ago where each one had like and then you, you took, each one had like a little square and you took that little square and you made like a, I actually did a video series on it and you used it. So I really am loving this. I really want to put it in another kit. I keep forgetting about it. Um, but it's basically like you could use this as different kind of journal prompts like making memories, take flight, our story make today matter so I really am going to incorporate this into my junk um, tag so I didn't want to I was gonna cut it up but I wanted to show you guys exactly it oh in the and you might be able to get it on um, get the this the actual paper pack um, here there and everywhere so that may be um, that may be something you look for um, like maybe on scrapbook.com or something like that I don't know. I don't know how old that paper line is either. I can't remember. I've had that for a while. So, um, yeah, I want to start using it. Okay, so let's put this one aside so we have space to play. I've got my hot glue gun heating up over here. I've got a basket of goodies here and all kind of things. So we have, um, we have some things to play with. So let me show you guys what was in the kit. I did sell out of this kit. Um, it's one of those kits that had, it didn't really, I ended up including a journal in it just because it was like my, 
I felt like I, I was like, you know, let me include a journal because it's like a journaling kit. And so I did include a journal. I'm not going to use the journal in this kit, but it does have one of these little wreaths in there. And so, yeah, so it's kind of summer themed. I did like a little cute little um, clip here. Oh, I, so I've been trying to include DIYs in kit in the kit. And um, I'm going to come back and do this project with you because I want to do it as, as a standalone video because it's so fun and easy and it's going to be one of those really quick and uh, fast um, uh, videos. So I want to do this in separate. But this is also came in there and it's making up a paper clip. I mean, a clothespin cheer pin. And I'll go in more detail. That'll be, I'll, I'll do that video next. And then it just has like a lot of, lots of ephemera to add into the journal and then of course the journaling cards that came in it which will be the main thing and then of course a napkin i love this paper <laughs> so cute popcorn bag and then of course stickers and then the pocket pal which is um i can't say i got the name of this i actually purchased something from pocket um pocket journal Pam and she sent it as called pocket pals and so I started making them as um, with my girls in there as a large die cut um, at a as swag and then I was like oh I haven't done a pocket pal or if I have it's been a while so we added a pocket pal because you know you need a pocket pal am I right <laughs> lots of pom-poms you know all the goodies that we can add into our journal and then um, let's see here. So in here was some kind of, I considered it like hardware, so to speak. Um, but this is, how fun is that? It's in a cotton candy bag. Uh, and then you have some washi tape, a pink flamingo pen. This is actually a stir, you know, so you can make you a fun drink. Because Best Summer Life's about making fun drinks, right? So we can do that. And then, of course, your washi and then your ring. So I'm going to save this bag because I'm, uh, I'm probably going to be adding it to something. Some, something I'll be using this bag in. Okay. So, um, so you may ask also, like, okay, well, you have this. What about your other journal? You could still use these items in... The, your other journal but the reason I um, I'm doing this tag is one I want to have like a whole display but I also kind of want to look at the special um, special moments that make summer summer so uh, for example um, one is having a fun drink you know doing something like that um, my birthday month, my birthday's in June. That's always been like a big deal for me because um, it was off for summer. You know, a lot of people were like, oh, my, my school, my birthday's in the summer. And, you know, I loved it. I, I don't know why I loved having my birthday in June. Maybe because it's my birthday and so it's like always been there. And um, I've told this story many times, but I lived across the street from my grandparents, right? And so I could not wait till my grandma would call me on the phone and tell me to come over and I'd come over and get my birthday present. And that was like, oh, the, the day, you know, I got a gift from my grandma. So that was like a big deal. Um, and um, so, yeah, so that's kind of like what makes my best summer ever. Um, the other thing I thought about, because, um, you know, to me, I love the beach. Don't get me wrong. I love the beach. But I do not like beaches that I have down here because... It's so, I mean, even going in November, I've never been in the beach in the winter. You know, maybe I should put that on my list. Oh, you know what? We could put that on my little 50 before 51 list. But I've never been to the beach. It's always been the summer. And the last couple times, it's just been so hot. I got terribly burned one year. And we were only out there a couple hours. And I'm scared to death of the sun now. <laughs> because I did so much damage as a youth. <laughs> But anyway, I can't say I don't like the beach of the summer. I'm not a big Texas beach person during the summer. Like I said, maybe during the winter months, it's nice. I don't know. Um, okay, but jumping forward to 
um, and this is just all my opinion um, but I just went and also pulled some things out of my stash the other thing that was in this kit I, I'm pulling those out um, is um, there was a pink flamingo ribbon if you got it but um, I um, I didn't have enough for my kit so I just pulled out some ribbon from my stash and that's definitely something you can use um, anything I mean this that's what makes a junk tag right is having all the fun things out of your stash and these scissors are not the best <laughs> they don't, don't want to cut nothing let's see here okay. that's better okay so I kind of wanted to do a comparison on this one because I did want it to be similar to the same length so when it hangs, even though that, that thing that I'm thinking about hanging them on isn't exactly the same. I think they have different. No, it is the same length, I think. And really, I guess it doesn't matter. But I'm just kind of trying to have it somewhat, you know what I mean? Like somewhat close. Let's see. Been that, and I've been this. I should have taken the. I might need that. I was thinking about taking that wire out, but I may actually use. Let's see if that will hold it. It'll be the same. Yeah, yeah, perfect. Okay. And again, this is just what I'm doing in my little art room. Um, this this um this tag could be a great gift what am i doing here oh let me cut this excess off i feel like that's just going to cause me more more grief on trying to figure that out <laughs> square that up a little bit so the other thing like I keep thinking about is um, I love going net to the movies um, one of my favorite things as a kid and you know I'm thinking too it's like even writing memories down like going to my grandma's you know having her call me come over and get your gift you know I used to love that but even like when we um we were kids and we never so my parents worked you know we were like the stay-at-home kids you know so we couldn't really go anywhere because my mom was like no you're not going anywhere until I get home <laughs> um but one of the fun things about that was um we um we would like play in a sprinkler I mean literally we did and um, um, we didn't really we did have a neighborhood pool for a little bit but it wasn't did I glue this like no I think I did oh yeah I glued this to this I was gonna say that seems like it's sure is loose but um, so but I, we, I used to love even like getting play in a sprinkler and um, coming inside and then like getting on your dry clothes and being just warm you know <laughs> and getting a blanket because it's summer and you're like cold but um, yeah it was it was always like fun I love that feeling of getting um, getting dressed like after swimming and then having the dry clothes on. I don't know. It's just a good memory. So one of the things I also thought about doing was, and I should have brought my book in here because I've been going over. Remember the book I had, uh, Romantic Romanticize Your Life? And um, it had different things, like daily things you could do. And, you know, being that I am trying to, like, romanticize my summer because... Um, it is, you know, already been so humid and hot, and um, I keep thinking, I'm like, 
okay, how can you make this, you know, a good, how can you make this a positive instead of being like, oh, I'm so hot, it's, you know, um, and don't get me wrong, evenings are nice, you know, it's just, um, it's just the beginning, <laughs> positive, 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 um, but anyway, um, so I've been looking at my romanticize your life, um, thing that I, book that I have, and they have some really great ideas, so I'll have to show them to you. I am going to be doing some things on Instagram, um, I've been making those, make, having fun making reels and stuff like that, so there is a couple things that I'm going to do that I think would be a lot of fun. This reminds me of Summer more, but it's kind of big, so I think I'll come back to that. Okay, let's see here. Um, so one of the things I know right off the bat, I'll, I'll go ahead and tell you what I'm going to do because I actually started making the video last week because I ordered my lotion, my favorite lotion of the summer, right? Or I have a couple that I wear. I'm a Bath and Body Works girl. And so um, they said, pick your scent of the summer. Well, I actually had picked out this scent. I've had it for, I use, I've worn it for two years now, and actually I didn't think they had it last year, so I ordered it off of Amazon, but they have it back in the store this year, I think, or maybe they did, but I was looking for it too early or something, but, um, this mob is giving me total 80 vibes, <laughs> um, but, so, so anyway, it's like one of the things in the book, it says pick your summer scent. And I was like, oh, I love that because I, I have a summer scent that I wear. And actually I have two. So I, I wear the, the um, I wear the, what do you call it? Um, crack pop. It's like um, fireworks, but it's very summery and it comes out at summer. And then the strawberry pound cake. I wear that as well so that's so cute then we can always add some roses because roses are June's flower and they bloom like crazy in the sum summer let's see I don't know I kind of like it with just the the bow, it looks really pretty versus adding the flowers. Oops. Okay, we'll come back. Maybe we'll, maybe I'll add those later. So I could, I could, I can't spit out. Cause I kind of just like the bow. Okay, so I'm gonna save my drinky, my drink stir. Got my pen over here. Got some of my pom poms. Okay, here's my ring. So let's go ahead and start punching holes to add the rings. So I'm just going to really do these right smack dab in the middle. And I love these because um, even if you don't like, because you're like, oh, you, well, I guess it, you know me. I could I could match up anything, right? <laughs> but if it's too like, you know, maybe not exactly the vibe you're going for on your, you could. These are great cards to um, to cover to cover up. They're real sturdy. They're that Cartabella as well, and you can always use the other side. See, so like best beach day ever. I'm not even gonna put. Well, I'm gonna put it in there. You never know. My daughter wants to go. She said I am going to the beach, and we're about two hours, three hours from the beach, depending on where you want to go. Um, I mean, Texas has a big beach, right? So um, it could be more, it could be less. It could be seven hours if you want to go to Sao Padre, you know, which is probably really pretty. But um, I love that one. But, um, 
And these, I think I'm just going to... Maybe cut out these larger ones. But, um... You couldn't... What I'm saying is you could make a day trip out of it. It would be a tiring day if you went all day and... But I guess if you spent a couple hours... Okay. Here comes the sun, little darling. I know. Every time I see that, I want to sing that song. You didn't know you're all going to get sung to today, did you? <laughs> so with this, I think I'm just going to rip this right down the middle. I love this cotton candy. Are y'all a cotton candy fan? I don't know if I am. I used to be, but I think it's kind of really sweet now, so it's not as fun. I remember my kids never liked it really, which always surprised me because as a kid I was like, oh my gosh, cotton candy, you know, and now, and I remember them, I remember they were older and we bought it and they were like, oh, this is awful. <laughs> and we're going to use this as an envelope on our tag. Okay. So, let's go ahead, and the popcorn bag, I don't, I, I was thinking about this, like how to use this. Like I, I love the fill, I love brown paper crepey fill, you know, I could do that. Okay, so let's add it all onto the ring here. Oh yeah, and then my envelope. Put Papa. And that can be added for fun things. So I'm gonna add the big stuff in the back for now. And so what I plan to do is basically um, just do like I do with my journaling pages, is come on and, and um, show you guys how I plan on using my little tag. use different different sizes that's what makes it so fun and junky lots of room to keep memories on here I know I was looking through my um, stuff the other day and I came across and I've been wanting to get on here I've been packing up orders so if you, for the uh, Wizard of Oz camp. If you guys are not familiar with the Wizard of Oz camp, it's happening next month, all month long. We're going to be doing adding things to a journal for Wizard of Oz camp. You can use your everyday journal. You can make a journal. Um, I'll, be, I'll be talking about all the things and I have different prompts. I'll be having a calendar come out very soon. You know what I need? I need to add my paper doily on here. I think I'm going to put my Akeem up here. And then this little guy is just too cute. We need a string for him. Hmm. Um. So yeah, so it's going to be a lot of fun. I hope you will join in. And again, it's going to be up on YouTube all the time. So I know like summer days are really busy. Um, I'll have to get a string for this little guy. I don't see one up here right off hand. I, did, I do have one up here. But let me get that real quick. Okay. 
anyway I'll be doing an introduction video soon for that it's kind of like the Anna Green Gables if you guys joined in on the Anna Green Gables last year it's gonna be very uh, it's similar except we're doing Wizard of Oz this year Oh man, okay, I'm gonna have to double knot it. Oh, I think my babies is here. I heard him pull up. My babies is my dog, Poke. <laughs> Every time he comes home or we get home, he has to say, hi, 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 you know. Okay, that has a knot in it on top of a knot. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. All right, and then we're going to loop this in like this, and we can add as we go. How adorable is this? Yeah, so this is just the beginning stages. I got to add my girl in. I hate to punch a hole in her head, but sorry. Okay, I've got to add her in here. She's our main girl. But, um, what we're going to do is I got, so this is basically getting it prepped. I'm going to have to do something with that tag. It's hanging way too low, but we'll fix it. And then I can always come in and add like, you know, this, endless possibilities, this, or maybe this. You know, so yeah, we're gonna have fun. Let the summer begin. All right, you guys, we're ready. I hope you, I can't wait to see. Share what you're doing, let me see it, and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.